Blackshan, and you are listening to the MBS show. Yay! Hello and welcome to the MBS show, episode number 161. I am your host, Norman Sanzo. Joining me today is Ro. Hello, all you happy people. Hello, Ro. How have you been, man? Busy, busy, and very busy. Oh my, busy. So that's good. Nothing but artwork everywhere. <laughs> That's good. Our thing is making you busy, so that's always good. Yes, it's that time of that season again. Yay. And also joining us is King. Hi, guys. Hey, King. How are you doing, man? I'm in a similar state as Roll. Um, the, all, all the comics, all the Tumblr reaction uh, responses. The reaction video got a lot of likes. I just, oh, I saw so that. So much thing need making, yeah. Uh, yeah. I saw that got, what, 316 views? Awesome one, that, man. Yeah. Yeah, first video got 360, that was good. Uh, but the tone was suddenly getting an influx of questions as well. <laughs> oh, so God. that's that. And then I've got the commissions, and then the not safe work art I've been asked to do. It's oh, stuff to do. Well, being busy is good. Oh, cool, 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 cool. And also joining us today is Lucky Knight. Thank you for having me, Norman. Yes, I'm Lucky Knight, and um, it's been it's going to be a very exciting week because I'm just wrapping up season two of my podcast, um, the brother show to the MBS show. Um, I'm Bernie and I'm proud and uh, we're finishing up our second season this weekend and we're starting our epic five season saga starting next week. So um, very exciting. How many, how many seasons are, oh, sorry, how many episodes are in an epi- season? Wow, I can't speak. Uh, yeah, uh, about 10 episodes per season. Ah, cool, 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 so, cool. If you're on your, you're going on to your fourth one now, did you say? Third. Third, you're in the, yeah, Jesus, 30 episodes already. Wow. You work fast, bro. Yeah, you work <laughs> fast. <laughs> it's fun though. True, 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 true. Creating content is always fun. Anyway, um, King, you mind introducing our next guest? Because since I think you and this person are best yeah. friendsies. This is my friend Blair. This is Blair Chan. Say hello, Blair. Hello. <laughs> yeah, yeah, guys, check this out. I brought a girl onto the podcast. What are you gonna do? <sighs> do our jobs. <laughs> <laughs> Let me have this moment. Okay, okay. I'm sure the audience will appreciate this. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> say hello, Blair. <laughs> oh. Hello. For the second time. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about King. He gets easily excited. <laughs> You make me sound like a puppy. <laughs> no, yeah, sorry, sorry. He wet the carpet. <laughs> Gets excited quickly. Oh my god! <laughs> uh, Blair, you mentioned earlier that this you... is going to be great. I know, Blair. You mentioned earlier that you were nervous and whatnot. Yeah. yeah. So I don't think you need to be nervous right now. I, I think you need to be face palming really hard. She, she does that. She does this thing where I say something stupid and she just stops talking and we all ask her what's up and she just, she just, sorry one second, she has the webcam on. She's just got a face in her palm. <laughs> she literally face palms. She doesn't talk. She's literally just she, <laughs> muting the mic so you don't hear this. Which is her uh... flapping her face with the face palm. <clears throat> well, that's good to know. <laughs> I can relate to that. If you remember correctly, my Skype icon was Captain Picard oh, mm. face palming. Yeah. Oh, yeah. For a long time. <laughs> because that was my entire reaction to everything for that period of time. Wow. <laughs> but, Blair, welcome to the MBS show. Um, how have you been? Uh, pretty good. Boring, boring days. School, art. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. So before we carry on, I need to ask you the four important question. And question number one is favorite character? Fluttershy. Fluttershy. <laughs> yes, another Fluttershy fan. Why Fluttershy? I guess she's kind of like me. I'm shy too. I love pets. Don't we all? I have four cats. Yay. Cats yeah, are cute. Yeah, nice. Nice. <laughs> I only have a dog. <laughs> oh. A dog? God. Any Any breed? Nah, just a normal doggy. Mm. All right, all right. She doesn't know. <laughs> Who knows? God. Cats, dogs breed. If you know them, that's awesome. But I think my cat is trying to kill me. I don't know. <laughs> all cats are secretly trying to kill their owners. That's a thing, isn't it? That's a rule. I know, but I mean, <laughs> I've got far too many animals in my life. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> Four dogs, two horses, three cats, a rabbit, and my little sister. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> what? I've got a lot of animals, man. <laughs> Including the last <laughs> one? What the hell? <laughs> oh, you know, she's... I can relate. You've not seen her after she's come... She, you've not seen her after she comes after, after the weekend. Hi, uh, guys. <laughs> and you've been drinking a lot, you party animal, you. <laughs> okay, anyway, moving on. <laughs> uh, what's your favourite episode, Blair? Uh, I guess uh, The Return of Harmony. Uh, the one with Discord. Yeah, that was the, actually the first episode I watched. How was it? Did you enjoy it? Yeah. What made you like it? Discord. <laughs> I just love this character. The, the ladies love Discord. It, it's a fact. I have yet to meet anyone in the fandom that's a female that doesn't just go, I love Discord. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, John Delancey so and Polaz. Oh, that's yeah. right. JDO. <laughs> I... I I think one of our audience members might be having some competition later on then. <laughs> so, how did you become a fan of the show? First, I saw the pictures on the internet, as probably everyone. Uh, then, uh, I was just casually watching TV, then I saw the, the episode, and I was just, oh, this is, this is the thing I, I saw on the internet. So I started to watch, and I started to like it. <laughs> Don't we all? I, I think I started the same way as you, but I did a lot more research and, oh god, what have I done with my life? <laughs> yeah, before I didn't know about the fandom and stuff. Ponies changed us. I don't know if it's good yeah. or worse. <laughs> so, what do your family and friends think about your love for that show? Well, uh, my family doesn't really care. <laughs> mm-hmm. All right. My friends uh, think it's okay. Uh, well, my class doesn't know. I just uh, they saw me draw uh, a pony or something. Then I, I said like it's for my cousin because I was too scared to to like say that I'm the fan of the show. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, I know how you feel. Search your feelings. You know it. Search your feelings. You know ponies to be true. <laughs> I know how you feel, Blair. I, I was like this, like that for the longest time. But uh, my actually, my housemates have sort of given me enough comfort for me to come out of the come out of my shell. <laughs> Come out of the stable, as they say. <laughs> of course. Ah, wow, the innuendos. Mm. <laughs> you made innuendo. <laughs> what they do? Nothing. Ah, oh, God. There, oh. there was innuendo? Where? Uh, in the window. Mm. But anyway, thank, thank you, Bert. Thank you. And like, like I'm trying to do something here that's kind of... Well, I forgot back when, when I first started this. And how has everybody been doing how has your week and i'm gonna go for row how has your week been man well like i said before busy had some work here and there to complete uh been out for easter after parties here and there yeah mm, yeah, yeah it's been busy but been quiet at the same time mm, busy and quiet at the same time playing any games yes i have done nothing but play dota for three weeks why Somebody were you help. playing dota I don't know, man. I don't know. Why well, you really can't stop the game? Yeah. I, I... It's not that I didn't chose the Dota life. The Dota life chose me. Uh, so... <laughs> uh, anyway, King, what about you, man? How is your week? Uh, I, like I said before, at the same as Rob, I've been really busy with all this stuff. But uh, outside of the Pony fandom, I've been just as busy, to be fair. Uh, started up my own business. Oh, fun. Yeah, um, basically the same as what I was doing before, but since I couldn't find a job, I thought, sorry, I'll do it myself, so I'm now a air quotes builder on my own terms. Oh. Um, Congratulations. Might be moving abro- yeah, I might be moving abroad. That's going to be fun. Oh. Good old Poland. Yay. Whoa, uh, Poland, represent. My Poland's are from Poland. Polska, Dines, woohoo, pierogi. Yay. <laughs> yeah, so I might be able to say hello to Blair at some point. Oh. But uh, that's, only, that's an if, that's an if. Blair, to move to school? Yeah, I mean, uh... Uh, uh, this is where we all be quiet. <laughs> oh but, uh, god, this is yeah, going start... to be fun. Yeah, I, I'm, glad I'm glad you're here, Lucky. I'm glad you're here, Lucky. You're moving to the Hoopaball School. Tell it, tell it. Yeah, pretty much. That's it. Um... <laughs> That's all you know, Lucky? That's all? Uh, really? He was asking Jim if Korea, you could yeah, Shimash. Yeah, that's right. Um, I'm coming to say thank you. So. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, outside, other than that, I've just been busy with learning how to edit videos for my reaction videos and trying my new Tumblr, which is, you know, the Tumblr. 
Getting a lot of asks at the moment. Oh, wow. But I like it. Congratulations, congratulations. Busy, busy. It's good, good. That's ridiculous. How have you been? (laughs) Well, I've been... Let me see. How do I put this? Since the start of the week. I have been on a crazy sleep schedule where I have not been sleeping well (laughs) and waking up stupid late. Other than that, um, gaming life, I... I recently recorded a video and uploaded it onto the YouTubes under my YouTube account. And it was a let's play of Left 4 Dead with, well, some of the guys in Team OK. There were some friends of mine and they met Team OK members and I think they clicked. They wound up bullying me because I'm the odd one out, as per <laughs> usual. No, I completely forgot about that. Yeah, I've been recording Let's Plays with you as well, haven't I? Just bits and bobs being edited together. Which... Oh, yeah. When it looks half good, I'll, I'll release them. But until then, let's just I keep it on my computer. Yeah, I, I need to do something with that. Like people been saying that it's a bit too long and it's not fun. So I might be shorten those. I might be shortening those videos in the future soon and make it more structured. Who knows? I I don't know. I mean, I'm I'm not a professional let's player. I do it for the funds. But other than that, uh, I and me all. Yeah, other than playing games i've been addicted to my other addiction magic the gathering we yeah th- there's nothing to say about that <laughs> friday was yesterday so yay and the show that's about it so blair what about you how has your week been normal life just school <laughs> uh, this week i actually started like a plan oh more like a schedule that uh, mm-hmm. i will draw something every day and keep improving it's working so far. Yay! The first week really is always is. the hardest. <laughs> I I need to I need to get into a schedule like that myself, really. <laughs> well, since you got school and whatnot, um, keeping to a schedule, well, it's not easy. But hey, good luck! I hope you manage to get a lot of drawings out of it. Yeah, thank you. No problem. No problem. I I already have like two to finish. <laughs> Yay! So anyway, uh, let me see. Hey, don't, hey Norman, don't you want to hear about my week? What, oh. what, what am I, chocolate here? What's going on? I'm sorry I was waiting for him to say something. I'm sorry about that because uh, <laughs> here's what's going on because I'm not clicking on the Skype and I don't see icons and names. <laughs> I'm sorry. So... <laughs> oh, I was going to say something and I did. <laughs> Blair, like I mentioned earlier, we're, we're full of, we're full of derps and you're, you're, you don't need to be nervous about it because like you just noticed there's a big mistake over there <laughs> i know i know so lucky how about you man oh you know what have i been doing well actually i've been um i did a blind reaction to um my little pony season five episodes one and two for the australia bronies oh. uh collaboration so um the um uh, my man David, also called the Brony Armorer, um, I believe, and um, he's done some test um, blinds for the latest music videos that came out from from the from the fandom. I mean, from the show. Um, funny enough, they were released just one week before the episodes. Um, why didn't they release it during the hiatus? Let's not try to go there. Um, so, and that went that went really well. So I did that sort of during the middle of the week and. Uh, it was uh, intense. I mean, uh, the episodes were definitely intense. Um, and, um, yeah, it definitely had me choking up about halfway through like I am now. And um, uh, editing the episodes um, for, for the podcast. And, uh, yeah, and actually I'll be um, – I just uh, booked a flight to fly down to Melbourne next week for, um, for an interview. So, fingers crossed, I might be moving back to Melbourne um, in June. So, Maybe living, leaving the beautiful, beautiful Queensland state. Oh, good luck, man. Good luck. Thank you. Hope you do well. And hope you get the job. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, Blair, like, oof, this, I, I, I don't know how to segue this, but you're an artist, right? Yes. Yes, yes, mm. yes. Terrible segue. But anyway, since that's out of the way, how long have you been drawing? For like one and a half year. Oh, really now? Yeah, my first drawing was like, crooked looking Fluttershy <laughs> with her legs bending the other way <laughs> everybody has to start somewhere my friend everybody has to start somewhere so you started drawing like one and a half years ago so did you start it off with ponies or did you do something else before that I I was trying anime uh, style for a long time but it didn't go well 
then I started to do ponies. Then uh, half a year later, I got my first drawing tablet and seriously drawing. Mm, so, so you just draw and draw and draw until you get into the rhythm. Yes. Ah, I, I see you do a lot of ponies, and I see King's OC here. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. Like she said, she started a year and a half ago, around the same time as me, if I'm not mistaken. And while I've brought it up in the past, I've been like a sort of steady, but slowly but surely sort of thing. She's like the hare in the tortoise and the hare story. She's been going really fast, only instead of him tripping up later on, she's just won the race and keeps on going. She's getting really, really good. And as a friend, I'm proud of her. It's amazing how quickly Aww. she's getting good. And I'm really looking forward to like the comics I've heard about. Oh, Those yeah, yeah. Fun. It's a mystery for now. <laughs> uh, cool, 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 cool. I mean, everybody likes a good mystery, and from... but eventually, all mysteries must be solved. Oh, true. That. <laughs> and from... or released in this case. <laughs> oh, true. And from what I'm seeing here, your art's not bad. It has its own style, and you know what? We need more of those kind of artists in the fandom with their own style and whatnot. Yeah. <laughs> So, what app are you using to draw? Sai? Photoshop? Sai. Ah, Sai. It's like the best program for me. I didn't get the, the license, license version, but shh. Yeah, nobody needs to know that. <laughs> uh, right. Bot, help us. Bot's the editor, not the hacker of the show. What's your inspiration for your art style? Well, my little pony, other artists. Because I'm seeing... One here, the flutter bed, and that looks awesome. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> those shadows, those lighting effects, that can yeah. be easy. Yeah, this this ain't easy, man. I was struggling for uh, with the lighting for like I don't know one hour. Oh, like, I was trying to make to make everything perfect. Lightings are not easy, and from pure darkness to bright off the brightness of the bat, that, that's uh, 180 because from light to dark, then that can be easy. Yeah. It's, it's, it's nice to see the, it's easy to see the contrast when it goes from pitch black, well not pitch black, but very dark to very bright. You can clearly see the, the contrast much easier and I think you pulled that off really well here. Mm -hmm. I say, acting like I'm a pro and I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know Roll, what? help me, I don't know nothing. <laughs> To be honest, Does it look I... Like I know? <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I didn't have any idea what I was doing. Don't we all? <laughs> That's the beauty started... of being an artist. <laughs> yeah, I just started sketching something that I thought about drawing flutter buttons. The NBA show's guide it. to being an artist. Step one, pick up pencil. Step two, have no idea what you're doing. Step three, publish. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so true, so true, so true. For so... profit. Get profit. <laughs> Uh, but any of you artists got any question for Blair? Because I'm sure you guys have questions for her. Teach me how to get better as quick as you, please, please, please. <laughs> no problem, man. Just whenever oh. you have time. I always have time. Always. <laughs> Teach me. All right, then. Good on you, Blair Senpai. Actually, I have a few questions. Um, whereabouts in Poland are you from? It's like um, south. South. Ah, oh, well, my family's from north, uh, from Dansk. Oh, nice. I'm actually from Sosnowitz. I don't know if you're not, if you know where it is. No. <laughs> boo. <laughs> well done. Boo. <laughs> Lucas, boo. Dude, I don't know I, the name I, of the streets, around, and I've been quickly. living in my city for hundred for twenty years. <laughs> oh, hashtag Polska fail. Um, well, actually, no. Actually, I'm more Kangur because um, I was born in Australia. So, um, yeah. Um, for for those on the panel, for those in uh, Radio Land, uh, Kangur is what they call um, son of Polish or or you know, daughter of Polish parents born in Australia. So you might see you might see me hopping around between podcasts. <laughs> and I see is the, is it your C on your profile? That's actually right. That actually is done by the awesome um, Essential and Main Six Swag. Um, uh, my first OC was actually done in po Pony Creator by yours truly, um, as we all. But um, got to start somewhere. And um, well, Team OK, you know, they came to my aid and said, "Oh, you know, the, the biggest joke in Team OK is draw my OC," and I was. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I was too afraid to ask, and um, they ended up saying, oh, oh, yeah, we'll do it. And then, you know, Ace did the sketch, like, you know, in 10 seconds flat. Um, and um, and I tell her, my OCs never looked 
cooler. I would say 200% cooler. How do you like them apples, Rainbow Dash? Although, you know, <laughs> Rainbow Dash is my best pony. I think I think that's all the questions I've got. Wow, really? Yeah. It's, it's just, you it's, have more, right? It's just lovely. Um, well, it's, it's just so lovely to meet, um, to meet so, someone else is Polish. So it's like, oh, and, Yay. um, <clears throat> and I guess I guess I can relate that to my OC because um, it's supposed to it's got Polish colors. It's supposed to be white and red, yep. especially the man. Yeah, the flag. So, yeah, represent. Bro, you have something to say and, because yeah. <laughs> Do you draw anything else besides ponies? Maybe, possibly. Mm, I don't think so. Really? Actually, I think I drew like an anime girl, but it was an accident. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you draw Slender before? Oh yeah, but it was a fail. Really? I thought it was good. Oh, well, thank you. It's not that scary, but it still is good. Like, uh, no, 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 no. Now that I look at it, she does more cute than scary. Yeah, yeah. Which I like. Okay. No, no, that I look. At... Two ways to get ahead in this fandom: erotic or no. cute. And she does cute very well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got another question. I've got another Wait. question. Oh my god. Yes. Um, Blair, what would be your next dream project be? Dream project. Oh damn. Uh... Actually, I don't know. I was thinking about starting, like, getting into the, the animation. Oh? So you mean, like, doing any animations? Like, do animate um, cartoons or something like that? Yeah. Oh, yeah, wow, yeah. Well, that's cool. Awesome. I think uh, we I definitely know... know. Do <laughs> well, we definitely know a couple of people that might give you beer, might be able to give you a few tips, so yeah. True, true, true. true. So, talking about animation and videos, I do also see that you have a YouTube page. Yeah, I do. So, the YouTube page, I'm assuming it's um, speed drawing, something like that? Or... Yes, yes, yes. Oh. I didn't do anything in a while, but I'm planning to, like, redo everything. Oh. Like, st- uh, like begin again. Ah, okay, because I see here, last video was six months ago, and, well, I, from what yeah. I understand, speed drawings are always the bombs. So, you should technically do it, and... Probably, since you're saying you're drawing every day, why not record some of them at the same time? I know, I know. But I don't have, at the moment, I don't have a computer. Ooh. Like, my PC is all broken. It's turning off by itself and stuff. So I can draw on it. Oh, that, that sounds too Ouch. bad. Like, so I'm guessing you're just only drawing on pencil and paper? No, no, I got my laptop. But it's uh, too slow to record anything. Mm, okay. Well, slow computers are not fun. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I know how you feel. I know how you feel, Blair. I can't. I can't leave my computer um, unplugged for more than twelve minutes. Otherwise, it just shuts off. So I feel your pain. Yeah. Uh, can't do anything on the computer. You can't like like you said. You can't record, but like you can't do anything with it with a bad computer. Like you can't even write songs for like videos or anything like that, or music. Like a lot of musicians, for example, need the computer. <laughs> So that's good. Speak like speaking of the music. Like, um, what do you think of um, like the songs in the show? I think they're really well done. Like, um, sorry, oh, it's okay. I mean, it's all right. <laughs> I, I mean, here's the thing. I mean, we all love the song from the show. Daniel Ingram does a good job, and so does William Anderson. And talking about William Anderson, um, did you know that he's the composer for the show for the background music? Anyone? Oh, wait, background music? I thought that was Daniel Ingram. Daniel Ingram does the song for the show as in the singing song, like the intro, the oh. theme song. Yeah. Oh, so you mean like the back, like what's in the background when we, when they're talking and stuff like that? That's pretty cool. Mm-hmm. I like that. But that was also Daniel. Oh, well, my bad. <laughs> it's, no, it was, it was William Anderson. And talking about William Anderson and his thing, um, episode 100 yeah. is coming so soon and he, Yay. He's finished with it. Like, he's done. Wait, done as in done for the show? Or no. he's finished it as in he's ready to release it? Episode 100, it's done. It's in the can. And there's a special guest yeah. within Ooh. it. It's Gina Guo. I cannot say her name. Ooh. Gina Guo. Uh, well, Bro, you, you're probably yeah, Bro, you, you do yeah. know, right? So, what's your take on this? Well, Willem Anderson, the composer for the MLP French Biz Magic, has finished composing music for the 100th episode. He has revealed a bit more information of his work with episode 100 of our DeviantArt. Oh, really? What did he say? The exact quote. I just finished scoring episode 100 of My Little Pony Friendship is Magic. It came out great. This is a neat instrumental set piece featuring Tina Gu. It, please, I tell me I pronounced that correctly. So. Uncello. Rockin'. 
airs June 13th, I believe. And I am doing the third Equestria Girls movie, which is called The Friendship Games. Life oh is busy God, and no. fun. <laughs> oh, my so God. Really, I was what? right. For those who are wondering who ah. Tina Gu is, um, she is a Chinese cellist and archivist from Shanghai. She moved to the United oh, States at the age of five. She has appeared as a soloist with the San Diego Symphony and other orchestras, and also plays in a progressive metal band. Hmm. Well, Ooh. now we know who... Soro. <clears throat> Soro. Yes. You said cello. Do you know what that means? Uh, no, no, no! Octavia doesn't play. No, I don't know anything about this episode. No, spoilers. Oh, no. Although, although a third movie, I'm really looking oh, forward to. Oh yeah, I, oof. because mm, okay, episode 100. I got no idea. Okay, I do have some idea, but I'm not going to spoil it because it could be just rumor speculation. So don't you even. Know. Okay, we have. Wait, what episode are we on uh, now? Oof. Um, I, okay, guys, we're on 94. Thank you. So six, <laughs> we, six episodes, so six weeks from now, we'll see episode 100. Probably if the... Oh, my gosh, oh, my gosh, oh, my gosh! It's like one and a half, two and a half. I cannot calendar. No problem, no problem. I cannot <laughs> calendar. <laughs> so we've got one that can't math and one that can't calendar. Uh, I can't I do I both. I can't English. I can't English. So. Uh, I can't live. Uh, but anywho, yeah, so we got... Episode 100 coming soon, and I, I think Will said that it's going to be on June 13. So that's going to be awesome if it comes out on June 13. And we're not going to say anything about the cello. So no, 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 no. Oh, so, nope. anywho, about to do a runner. Um, not listening. <laughs> on top of that, we also get a confirmation of Equestria Girl, the Equest- the friendship games. So that's going to be fun, right? Who here? That I am. Who here to likes it? E- <laughs> oh, sarcasm in voice. I hear Blair. You don't like it? Be honest. Be well, honest. Uh, my opinion. Careful. Careful. Forget him. Forget him. Because I'm sure. I'm sorry. <laughs> so you don't like Equestria Girls? Too creepy. No, but I. F- the first movie was okay, but the, the second movie that there. You don't like the second movie. There were just too many things from like that remind me of high school musical, <laughs> and I hate it. Okay, <laughs> granted, granted. Uh, anything that reminds you of high school musical. Rainbow rocks for me. So <laughs> <laughs> many songs. I just faced us. Wow. Um. Uh, no. let's, let's not ruin childhood memories for. King anymore. <laughs> That's not. <laughs> he needs to have seen tax. <laughs> the children. Next thing you're gonna say is that like the episodes are directly inspired by the original toy line or something like that. <laughs> no. <laughs> Questionable. So but oh god, Twilight no. Oh. You know, Equestrial for me was fun and all, but it always goes to the ponies because the ponies are always fun and that's what we want. And you know, you know, like, you, you know, the ponies have, like, their toys, and they look mm. all right. But have you seen the Equestria Girls toy line? Mm. That's just... Yeah. <sighs> and speaking of toy lines, Ooh, did you guys you hear up. that Bonnie... <clears throat> did you guys hear that Bonnie Zakula, the creator of the MOP toy line, is coming to Everfree Northwest? Ooh. Oh, is yes! that yeah, rent at Everfree Northwest yeah. uh, getting her? Oh, wow. That's cool. Yes. Before Lauren Faust and the DHX team, there was Bonnie Zakula, the original creator of the My Little Pony line. And we have the greatest privilege of announcing Ms. Zakula attendance as a special guest at Area Free Northwest 2015. That's right, the woman whose toys first inspired Lauren Faust and who laid the new, the groundwork for all future generations of My Little Pony franchise will be joining us in Seattle. Ooh. Wow. That's their announcement. <laughs> so, wow. I've never bought any of the toys or anything like oh, that. Oh, really? No. So, I I don't have any toys. I have prints mm. and the move, and the DVDs. That's about it. And um, the fan art. Got... I well, have yeah, to admit, but... I, I have to admit, I do have a rainbow power rainbow <laughs> dash. Hey, it's cool. Wow. It's cool. I have a Hasbro. I have a Hasbro toy. And it's not that bad. Hey, it's cool. I love her mane. Um... <laughs> uh, I... I really like her mane. <laughs> <laughs> so Blair, do you, do you have any? Uh... I suppose that, that is the main selling point of the toys, true. isn't it? You can mess around so, with them. Uh, Blair, do you have any of the toys? No, not yet. Uh, it's cool. It's cool. Sadly, it's cool. It's cool. Same here. Same here. But now my local store does. Sell, I recently discovered my store does, in fact, sell My Little Pony 
stuff like dolls from Equestria Girls, the regular ponies. But they're so darn expensive. Oh. Like, oh my god! How expensive are we talking about here? Uh, let me see. Around no, thirty-five like euros for a My Little Pony figure Ooh, with the big mane and brushes. Ooh, wow. Yeah. And I think the Equestria dolls maybe about. I don't remember exactly. I'm afraid to lie, but maybe forty euros, fifty, give or take. I'm not 100 percent sure right now, but I do remember the price bit me. Ooh. Wow. <gasps> not literally, that, of course. Put the price down. <laughs> but um. <laughs> Uh, but uh, I suddenly feel that joke. <laughs> that was too dark. Pun. Okay, but you, there's a double. Put your dog down, pawn, and uh, then put the price down. But you know, um, uh, talking about the pony toys, um, you guys remember the Power Pony episode? Yes. Oh yeah. yeah. What about it? Yeah, go yeah. go Power Ponies. <laughs> what about it? Here's the thing. Um, I saw something on what you call this on Tumblr, and apparently they're making the Power Pony toys. And they're making it into a legit thing with main already styled. And I am going to link it into the, whatchamacallit, this Skype chat and take a look-see. And you can thank our good friends at Taobao for leaking news because they oh, look wow. good and I want them. <laughs> Actually, no, those do look kind of cool. I know what you mean. They look good. In the words of in the words of Blind One Husband of Simpsons, I want it, I want it. No, no, no. It was Wayland Smith. It's I want it, I want it, I want it, I want it, I want it. Oh my goodness, that is best hair. Oh my god. I, oh wow. But I think we're missing the whole point of Bonnie Zachary Zachary going to Ever Free because our good friends at Ever Free um, managed to get her one of the originals. Like from what I understand, like you can. The yes, original, the original not one the originals. Like in the fandom, you can have only two OC alicorns. That's Bonnie See? and Lauren. Those are the only two that people do not mind. <laughs> and what are Celestia and fandom. Luna then? Fandom, bro. Fandom. Oh, yeah. So right. those are the only two that the right. fandom don't mind at all. And getting her there. Oh wow! Oh, phew, good, good job, Everfree. Now, now I want to go there. Uh, does any? Major respect. Bro, bro, when's ever free? When's ever free? Let's see. According to the according to the data I've gathered, it's going to be around May 29th to the 31st wow. this year. Ooh, oh man, wow. I can't. Tempting, I can't tempting. go. I can't go. That's too short. That's too short on time. <clears throat> that's okay. We'll ship you in a box. No, it's okay. Be... <laughs> I'll miss one. I'll miss episode 100. No, we'll record it for no. you on tape. Uh, but tape. <laughs> Tape. Oh god! Now think about it. Yeah, I'm going to a, a con in <laughs> July. I'll miss an episode. <gasps> I'll miss. No, no, I can't do that. I can't. I can't go to a. Can't. Don't can't worry. I'll have an extra you. tape can't. for you. <laughs> and, yes, ladies and gentlemen, again. I use. And yes, ladies and gentlemen, I use tape because, well, not everyone can afford DVDs. <laughs> DVDs. <laughs> what are DVDs? What are those? I live in the Stone oh Age. God. Okay, cut me some slack. What is a tape? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Blair, do you do you, do you yeah. know what floppy drive are? Floppy disk, oh, sorry. Yeah, hey, yeah. I yeah, thought I this call was safe for work. Oh. <laughs> I am not that young. Uh, no. My little cousin I was actually helping him write um, a CV oh. for uh, like a, a mock CV because mm-hmm. he's in school. And I said, right, we'll just cl- just click on that up there. I said, yeah, I'll post on the save. And I went, wait, the what? And he said, the save. I said, do you know what that is? He said, yeah, it's the save button. No, 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 no. What is that a picture of? Yeah, a save. No. Do you know what that is? He said, yeah, it's a save. I, I had to explain to him what a floppy disk was. And he went, oh what? how does it work? I had to explain to him that it had about a couple mm. of megabytes, if you were lucky. <laughs> and he went, wait. Oh, did you mean, really? Did you mean gigabytes? Oh, I'm lucky. Yeah, and I, he said, did you mean gigabytes? And I said, no, <laughs> megabytes. And he didn't understand the idea that a computer or a floppy disk couldn't handle less than, like, a gig. Now I no. feel really old. Yeah. Oh. So, so really had trouble making a hard copy then. The I still remember how I used my floppy disks. Mm. Oh, God. <laughs> I think I still we have some. We oh. all do. Actually, it reminds me, because I, um, I once submitted it, submitted some promotional material for, like, a film festival or something at uni, at uni. and um, I actually handed it on a floppy disk 
and the guy who gave it to looked at me funny. And I said, what? Um, we only take CDs. And, um, of course, you know, everyone's using Macs at university, and it's only CD sets. I had to specifically go to a computer that had a floppy disk drive, put the floppy disk in, put it on, and then burn a CD, and then get the CD. Wow. Okay. I'm going to do a little test with you th- with you four right now, and I'm going to include myself in this. I want you all to look at the device you're using right now to be a part of this mm-hmm. Skype call. Okay? Find a floppy disk, a place to put your floppy disk. None. Is there a place on your computer oh, to put a floppy disk? No. No? No. 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 Oh, well. no one. Okay. Well, maybe maybe this cor- thing. I don't know. I don't remember how big the floppy disk is. No, wait. No, it's a okay, different okay. kind of port. Never mind. I was hoping I have one no of floppy. you would say yes so I could go, Yo! <laughs> no, Ro- Rookie <laughs> King, here's the thing. I probably do have a computer that still has a floppy disk drive. And you you. it's somewhere, but my new rig does not have one. So, ha. Huh. Narrowly no, passed. No. You narrowly passed. Oh, but talking about... I may be it's, sorry for the segue, audience, but talking about floppy disks, like, do you remember back in the days, like, saving a MP3, just, just one MP3, you needed to have, like, five floppy disks, just to save one MP3, at low quality. I can beat that, I currently have downstairs, is a vinyl player. <laughs> Show off. Speakers, and one vinyl has one what? song. That is it. <laughs> I have vinyls downstairs that are entire singles, but they're like the size of, you know, dinner plates. Wow. <laughs> and I listen to that on a regular That's basis. That's still awesome. Uh, oh, so, cool. Sorry about that. Sorry okay. about that, Blair. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Vinyl? Poppy discs? What are those? Uh, I know what those my, are. Don't worry. Yeah. Actually, my local, um, one of my local shops actually has a whole vinyl oh, cool. section. This vinyl has come back with a vengeance. I mean, vinyl, yeah. vi- oh, vinyl never died, technically. It's always been there mm-hmm. because um, vinyl sound quality is much better than any CD or MP3 out there. Because it's... I know she, yeah. I know she's an, she's an awesome pony, isn't she? Yes. Ah, yeah. <laughs> uh, you. <laughs> We're talking about the vinyl scratch. Hey, uh, but <clears throat> she's going to bring the vinyl oh, back. Man. Hey. And if you notice, she doesn't use CDs. She uses vinyl on the deck. So, True. yeah. Hmm. But anyway, uh, Blair, <laughs> have you ever drawn vinyl? Oh. No, never. I should. Well, talking about all these vinyls, you, you should, you should, because, well, <laughs> like King said, vinyl's coming back. Yeah, you, you, I, I won't want. I might just commission to draw a, a vinyl. Oh, talk, you, you do commissions. Oh, yes. So, how much? Are your commission rates? Actually, points. Oh, points. so you're doing the DeviantArt points? Yes, yes. So how much is it? How uh, much do you charge? Well, um, I should probably put uh, prices a little bit up. But for now, there's... Uh, for a full picture, like full shaded with complicated background, it's 70 points. Uh, more than one pony, uh, like plus, plus 10 points. So I thought I was cheap. Jesus. <laughs> All the, all the commissions I think I'm going to get now. <laughs> so, Blair, have you ever thought about using or getting PayPal instead? Like, advancing to PayPal? I did, I did. Oh. Maybe in, maybe soon, I don't know. Uh, it's okay, it's okay. We're well, just thinking about it because I we have a friend who does co- a lot of commissions and he told us that DeviantArt points are a bit mm, too cheap, did he say? I think. Cheap. They're completely worthless. I, they, they're good on DeviantArt. You can add more subscription points to your DeviantArt. I'm sorry, but can you pay your bills with DeviantArt points? Mm. Buy a pizza? <laughs> go see a movie? No, true. Get those, oh, no. Re, I'll get that shiny thingy that I always wanted. I don't know what it is, but I want it because shiny of reasons. Thingy. <laughs> I don't know what I want yet, but I'll get it one day. Yes. Oh no! Did I did I just pay my pay for my flight with DeviantArt points? This is not going to work well. <laughs> oh god, no! Uh, but anyway, I can't pay that nice girl down the street to hang out with me for a few hours with DeviantArt points. <laughs> oh, sorry about this, Blood. But anyway, Blood, thank you for um, coming to the show and hanging out with us. Um, I'm sorry if we offended you in any way because nah, uh, I don't think you can offend her. She speaks to me. <laughs> 
And oh, actually, and I, if I can make a suggestion, Blair, um, you can set up a donation button uh, that's with a direct PayPal link. Um, so I can, if you if you want help with the code, I can help you out there. And so you can still keep the point system and um, get people to say, like, hey, you love my art, like the points, send me a donation, give it some love. Like the points, let me eat mm. tonight. <laughs> I need to eat. I need to eat and I need to buy that new fancy shiny thing that I still I don't know what yet. <laughs> shiny. We need to go on the quest for the shiny thing. <laughs> but, shiny pony, shiny pony, shiny pony. Yay. Uh, but anyway, thank you, Blair, for coming on. Uh, so, before we move on, Blair, where can the good listener find you online? On DeviantArt. Probably going to be in the link below, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. Yep, you will. And YouTube. That's about it. <laughs> so, this is the place. So, it's blairchan 231 dot yes. dot com and also oh on t- why do you hate us so much YouTube why is this no shortened ah <laughs> <laughs> oh do you know how hard is it to say your channel on the YouTube's it's like U C D A V X seven E no I'm not gonna finish <laughs> no, this I'm sorry I'll give, it, I'll, I'll give it a go I'll give it a go no 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 no, no, no. no. it's gonna be found in the show notes below <laughs> ladies and gentlemen <laughs> thank yeah. you Ro thank you for saving us. Uh, but anyway, <clears throat> if you have any questions, concerns, or suggestions for the show, you can contact us at mbsshow.gmail.com. Send us an email, because if you do, probably we'll read it on the show. And you can also reach us on Twitter. The show's Twitter account is at mbsshow. Sudibot will tweet stuff about life and whatnot. I got no idea what she's doing, because she's so secretive, like a ninja. A sneaky, sneaky ninja. No, she's and... not. I hit her in the closet because I accidentally spilled my Mountain Dew on your... Why would you do that? <laughs> do what? Spill Mountain Dew. Did I say that? I did not mean... I... I'll go you first. know, I'm going to keep I'm going to keep it for now because you're clearly irresponsible with her. <laughs> so, but, so that explains well, excuse me for having a lunch break. <laughs> do you remember the last episode we had? No. King accidentally slipped a word and she didn't catch it. No, oh, was that my I, fault? <laughs> no, no, no. What happened is, is uh, I, I, uh, and this is going to be an Easter egg. In fact, no, for you listeners that really, really care about this, it's going to be a little Easter egg. In one of the episodes I appear in, there's a little slip where Sweetie Bot broke down for a while and didn't catch a swear word. Mm. Go find it. <laughs> uh, and it was recent too. But <laughs> you can expect well, no, something was. good from something bad. Well, not that bad. Probably. <laughs> We uh, have but now if, entered the MBS zone. Oh, but <laughs> if you want to know what I'm thinking and what I like, you can catch me at Norman Sanzo. I usually tweet about food, toys, and my obsession with Magic the Gathering. It's a problem, I know. And Ro, where can they catch you, man? Uh, you can find me at Relicious on my Twitter, at Relicious <laughs> underscore art. I tweet about, well, random stuff. The first thing, I just, it's basically... A book where I write down my thoughts. And my gallery, relicious.dvnr.com. Mm-hmm. Good, 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 good. King? Uh, same as always, dvnr, kick-ass king. Um, uh, Steam, Xbox. But the two new places where you can find me are at a new Tumblr I've started, which is called Ponies Backstage, uh, which is about what it's like to record the show. Uh, and they'll be answering questions about the cast members and certain things in the show, which is it's actually really fun to do. So, I can see why Anticular Pony does it so much. It's really fun. So, King, 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 when you say show, you don't mean our show, right? You mean like... No, no, I mean show... the, My Little Pony show. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, okay, okay. For example, uh, in the process of recording this episode, I actually got one, and uh, it says, uh, so who's more of a diva, Twilight or Dit or Rarity? And... <laughs> I wouldn't know the answer to this because, uh, you know, it's going to be quite entertaining. Uh, the well, other place is Kick Ass King 1 on YouTube where I'll be doing the blind reaction, which is another thing I've got to do today. Mm-hmm. <sighs> and speed paintings when I get a chance to edit the videos together. And yeah. Let's Plays, of course. Cool, cool. And Lucky, what about you? Well, you could find me on the Hive Radio every Sunday at 8 p.m. Australian Eastern 
standard time. It's thank goodness now we're all on the same time on the same coast, which is good. Um, but actually, it's really awesome because we're now expanding to Cadillac Hill. So with the beginning of season three, Sunday next week, we'll be um, broadcasting live from my laptop. So it's going to be very exciting. Um, you also can catch me on the um, Australia Bernie's React and um, on the Twitters at... IBAIP show and of course on Facebook and don't forget to follow Relicious and Kick-Ass King on Picado. They stream like there's no tomorrow. Yay. You know what? I also want to add one thing. I also want to add one thing because I'm jelly of you guys. Uh, you can follow me at Norman Sun. So I do let's, well, I'm starting to do let's plays because let's plays are fun, right? And also, I, well, uh, I think I do Let's Plays, yeah. That's why I do Let's Plays. Apparently, I'm not as popular as King because I whoa. do well. <laughs> what do you mean I'm popular? Whoa, yeah. whoa, don't be calling me out for nothing. I'm not, I'm not even posted a Let's Play video yet. Well, okay. No, you're, you're blind. King's Let's Plays. I haven't done your one. Blind reaction video got about 320 views and my Let's Play with friends only got 14. That says a lot. Well, basically, listeners, if you want to see Norman owned by other players, please tune into Norman Sanzo Plays. It's an uh, awesome show. Yeah, it's, you can catch me on YouTube user Norman Sanzo. My YouTube is special. <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> I, I was there from the very start to get it done. Everyone's special. <laughs> Yay! Except... Everybody's special. <laughs> Everybody's Everybody special. special. Get onto the bus. Everybody special. <laughs> uh, and also, please subscribe and rate us on iTunes, YouTube, and Stitcher Radio, and also like our Facebook page. You can catch us on PonyvilleLive.com. Links are in the show notes. So anyway, I have been Norman Sanzo. I am Relicious. Uh, I'm Kickass King. I am Lucky Knight. And I'm Blashon. <laughs> Yay! We'll see you guys next week with more pimping out our YouTube pages because YouTube is fun. <laughs> Questionable, but yeah. And we'll see you on the next podcast. Bye bye. Bye guys, bye I bye. love you. Bye. 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 Bye.